welcome back to my channel. Uh, so I kind of previewed this a little bit in my unboxing video. Um, we are dyeing my hair and doing a review on the L'Oreal Paris uh, Midnight Bold. It's like a four process uh, hair dyeing, which is really cool. It's something I haven't seen before. And we're doing it in the color Blood Red, which I'm super excited about. So we read the instructions. Um, so it says to take this shimmering conditioning developer cream and we're going to mix it with let me go ahead and get my hair because immediately as we do this i've got to start okay so it says to take this and the shimmering conditioner color gel and mix it that does not look red at all maybe that's the red sorry my hair is crazy y'all Oh, did it just get red everywhere? Yeah. Oh, here, I'll go ahead and mix that. Okay. Here. here, I got that. Okay, and then to um, add in what's called a optimal color booster for like red. Um, color booster. Color booster, yeah. And then to add a aromic shimmer serum. Which I don't know what that's for. If I can get it open. It's got a thing. Oh, no, I'm going to cut it real quick. We got some red on the kitchen counter. <laughs> We've got some wops that mom's working with right now. Well, I'll get this poured. In. Oh, God. Okay. So, we're mixing this all together. That is going to be red. Okay. Is it coming off? That's coming off pretty well. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to do this over the trash can. I'm just shaking the bottle. <laughs> How long does it say to shake it for? Uh, until content, contents are thoroughly mixed. I can still see the conditioner and stuff. No, it's got a cap. I ain't getting it oh, a little bit, but it has a cap that comes off. Yeah. So. So I'm doing it towards the trash can. That way I don't get it in the mixture. Say hi to the fans, Dad. We're videotaping me dyeing my hair. <laughs> okay. I just don't want to get this on anything, so I'm getting it over the trash can. Do you think that's really mixed? Mm -hmm. Okay. Alrighty, so as soon as immediately after mixing, start from the roots and work our way through. Alright, so I've got a throwable shirt away on. So mom is going to start. I'm gonna take my glasses. So mom just you're good. Go ahead. Mom just started applying it. Oh my landa. <laughs> Looks like I'm bleeding. When we dyed my hair purple, we did we had a lot more to work with than this like bottle. But it also comes with a lot more like steps than the other one did. I hope it turns out really red, like the red I want it to turn out too. But it does look, if you look at the top of my head, it looks like I'm bleeding. <laughs> That's the strangest thing for me. Because I've always kept my hair brown. Like the most I've done is, you know, dye it the purple shade I have right now. But it really isn't as noticeable. Um, and I've dyed my ends like dark purple, but I've never dyed my hair like my whole head 
like this broad of a color. So. It's not getting as saturated as the purple. Well, it, it, color it does say to start at the roots and just work it down. And then whatever's left over, you use to saturate the ends. So it's focusing more on the roots first. But. Yeah, we've got my hair sectioned off. I'm actually going to like put that in my shirt a little bit just so I can keep it sectioned. But this is actually mom's second time dyeing my hair. And you said you've never dyed your own hair before, mom? Not personally by myself. Someone else has dyed my hair for me before. I have a feeling we're but going your to. Your hair is the first one I've ever dyed. Well. I have a feeling we're going to have to do like we did last time. We had to take makeup wipes to get the dye off of my face, which actually worked really good. It actually worked wonders for us. But I'm not afraid to get it on my face because I'm not going out anywhere for like a week. So it should be fine. And then as soon as like we're done, I'm hopping into the shower. So I'm going to like wash it off that way. So I'll give you, you're going to see me like dye, dyeing process. And then you'll see the after effect after it's like dried and washed and everything. <laughs> it looks like blood. I'm telling you. It really does. It looks like someone has literally just bashed my head in. It's okay. Maybe I'll take a picture of my face and be like, should see the other guy. <laughs> it's not that bad. I thought it was going to be a lot redder. Hair. A little bit of hair. The baby hair on my ear. Last time we did. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about getting it on my face, mama. Seriously. Don't worry. But, um, last time we did this, this little hair right here, there was like a little piece of hair that just perfectly curled. And I was like, it's so cute. So, yeah. You guys are seeing the raw Anna, you know, hair down. So yeah, I, I will update when we have a little bit more of the hair uh, dyed. For you guys, it'll be a second. For me, it might be a good minute. So I will pick up here in a minute when we have more hair dyed. Okay, so we are pretty much almost done. We've gotten the whole head done. This is what the face looks like. But, of course, like I said, we're going to take some makeup wops. I did get a little bit on my hand. Uh, it's pretty red. <laughs> so, but, I mean, it looks good so far. We're just getting, like, the last bit done and, like, saturating it really fully. Uh, we thought we were going to need more than one box. Um, but, thankfully, so far, this box is working pretty well. We're almost done. Um, you guys can get it if you like. I was sent this uh, box of hair dye by Influencer. It's a app that I have where, for my honest feedback, I review their products. I give them my honest feedback on it, and um, I get to ha like keep the product and try the product for free. So I don't get paid for this. I'm just letting you guys know that I this is for free products for my honest feedback. Um, but yeah, if you guys want the hair dye, they have it in different colors. They have Violet Escape. Orchard, Orchard Glow, um, they have like a azure, azure color, which is like blue, and then this one's called Blood Moon if you want red, so they only have like four colors like in this box, but they're like 10 bucks at Walmart, uh, of course you have longer hair, I would highly recommend doing two boxes, but if you have shorter hair, one box might do for you, mine's a little bit like down to here, so it's like sh a little bit longer than shoulder length, but not super long, so, but we were thinking two boxes were probably what we needed. But so far, one's been doing pretty good. Mom's just getting it super saturated right now. But um, once she's done, we're going to throw the timer on for 25 minutes. Let it sit and really uh, have the color hit all the color or hit all the hair and kind of just soak up that color. And then 
I'm going to go wash my hair out with the shampoo it gave us. Um, but I'm going to do like a, kind of like a shampoo, conditioner, repeat. So I'm going to use their shampoo and conditioner that they give you in the box. I'm going to rinse that out and then I'm going to use my own with the Redken product I actually got in um, the influencer box, I think a month or two ago, if I'm not mistaken. Um, for you guys, it may be a, a little bit longer than a month or so. For me, it was only last month. It was like beginning of March uh, or like end of February that I got it. So this one I just got um, this past week. So that one. <laughs> but sorry, that just amused me. That look, it looks like blood. It really does. Me and mom were sitting here talking about it, but, but yeah. So we're just getting the whole head saturated real quickly, and we're gonna throw the timer on for 25 minutes, let it sit, and then I'm gonna wash it out, and I'll show you guys the final result when it's dry, and really like, you can see the color. Howdy, so it is pretty saturated. We've got a lot of red on the face and the neck, but you know what? It's fine. We can clean that up easily. So, now I'm going to let it sit for 25 minutes, and then afterwards, I'm going to uh, use the shampoo that it gave us. Um, it uses a power shimmer condition that it gave us, and then it also gave us a conditioning shampoo. So, that's going to be cool to use. So, yeah, I'll let you know how it turns out. So, we cleaned up the edges a little bit. And the timer just went off, so I'm actually going to go ahead and, um, I'm going to turn my lights on. I'm going to go ahead, I'm gonna, actually in my bathroom, uh, I'm going to go ahead and wash out my hair. And it says to use the shampoo. I really hope this works because my towel is green. <laughs> I don't want red on my towel. Okay, so it says to take the shampoo and do it twice, like do the conditioning shampoo and do like a rinse through twice until the water's clear and then do the shampoo or the conditioner. And then after that, I'm gonna use my own. And it says to use it with warm water the first time, which it's permanent hair dye. So it's not semi-permanent, so you can use hot water. But every time you do, a little more, like less of the hair dye is gonna come out. So, I'm going to go ahead and do that, and you guys will see the finished results here soon. So, I just got out of the shower, put my hair up in a towel. I haven't seen it yet. Uh, I will say the dye came off my ears pretty easily. And, like, I had some on my neck right here, and it kind of came off easily. So, I don't know. This still looks brown from what I can see, but we'll have to see. I will wait till it's fully dry, and I will show you the final look alrighty guys here's the finished look look it is so red like it's red y'all but I'm really happy with it and it's like a reddish brown that I really been wanting to do with my hair for a while it's still kind of wet underneath but I'm letting it dry but as like it's pretty much dry and I really love the color it's so pretty it's a lot more red in person though but I mean still it's very pretty and I love it so, if you guys enjoyed, you know, watching me dye my hair and going through this journey with me, please give the video a big thumbs up. There is a button down below that says subscribe. Don't forget to hit that. And there's a bell icon right next to it that alerts you when I upload so you don't miss a video. And it's free. So, if you enjoyed it, please give it a like and subscribe, y'all. And I hope you enjoy some more videos that are to come, like my New York trip that I've mentioned before and some other Renaissance uh, items and renaissance fairs that i'll be vlogging as well so i hope you guys enjoy it and i'll see you guys in the next video <laughs> bye bye